god. Oh my god, Eric. The last Godzilla versus Kong. That wow, was a damn bro! Good video, bro. bro. That was a damn good movie, bro. Yes, it was. Uh, you don't know. You know how many times I've watched it. I think it's on HBO. I played almost yes, l- literally every week. Once at least once a week, so I could Same just here. sleep on the couch while I'm watching it. I actually have a perfect. I have a great question that I need to ask, and I have a great and, answer. Right, but I want to know in the comments, guys. There are certain movies that you can only watch one time. There are certain movies that like a feel good movie, right, and. I'll watch it every night because it relaxes me. Not because the movie it's relaxing. It's just it has that effect on me. It does, yeah. Because Godzilla and Kong, you know, right. they're fighting. It's a lot of action. Right. It's not a relaxing movie, but for some reason, I'll find a movie and Kong is one of them that I'll watch right. every night. Right. No, but for us, I remember back in the days we used to watch uh, the Martin Lawrence Wa- reruns. Remember? Oh no, that of course. Yeah, well, yeah. I mean that forever we watched. That, that. Well, we that was to, every night. We used to watch Shallow Hal. We used to watch uh, the other Jack Black movie. Uh, uh, the year uh, one. Natural Libre. Year one. Natural we watched Libre. them. Every, you know, so every like night. this. Me, yeah, there's a couple of porn. Uh, that's a different story. But you know, I watch a lot of comedy at nighttime, and I watch the same ones over and over. I think there's like a psychological effect behind it because you know it for word for word. It plays in your head, kind of like when you're reading and then you fall asleep. Yes. At nighttime, I gotta wa- I gotta watch comedy to fall asleep. You know, at night, especially when you're tired, you don't feel like focusing on a brand new movie that you have to pay attention to it. Right. So you right. put something that you know makes you feel good that you can watch, and then you don't have to really right. pay attention and could just f- sit back right. and watch it. I've, I'm not gonna lie. I, I played the, the the Kim Kardashian sex tape. Uh, yeah, yeah. My God, bro. All right, so. I'm excited for this one, dude, because the last Kong versus Godzilla was really good. This is Godzilla X Kong. Okay, so X means I mean it it's could... no longer versus. If you realize that, because at the end of the movie, mm, if they you become... remember, mm-hmm. they became friends. Ah, they became friends. Why didn't they become friends? Remember, Godzilla whooped saved the planet. Kong. King... Yes. It, yes. Yes. By the way, Kong is my favorite. Kong is I, I side I side with Kong. King Kong would have won. You know right. why? Godzilla's arms. It's a dinosaur, boy. How's the, how's God, you know? He, yeah, he got them T Rex action. Yeah. Nah, God, but no, 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 no. He's uh, stronger than Kong. You think so? Because it's because if you remember, you got more yeah, weight. But, Kong would whoop his ass because a, a a gorilla has the arms. Right. You know, gorillas are like humans. They're you know, powerful, they, they whoop too much. Fucking ass and punch They're the powerful. shit out of you powerful yeah yeah and if you remember he had that hammer right he, like the thor hammer anyways they at the end if you remember he looked at him and he and he looked at him like he's like okay we're boys now godzilla goes in the ocean and then that was the end of the movie okay. so i'm thinking the boys in this one right they're probably yeah they're probably a few years in their friendship let's check it out this is called the new empire here we oh, go i'm down for that man Uh oh. Some light detector. Is that a light detector test? For most of human civilization. No, it's an earthquake detector. We believed that oh, life okay, sorry, could but... only exist oh, on the shit. surface of our planet. I wanna I, I really wanna see the new the new one, the new Even battery. The effects. Bro, it gives me the vibe of Michael. Wait, that's Godzilla because it's blue. <laughs> Woo! Is that no? What else were we wrong about? Well, Everything. Your. How is how is it happening oh, in the future? I, in 2024? Oh, oh, yeah. There he is. That's my this boy right there. More secrets than we could possibly. This guy will never die, no matter what. Oh shit! What? What the? What hell is? What is? Uh, still what, is now and then. what the hell? Oh. He has a baby? That? That's not Kong. Uh, you're about to find okay, out. <laughs> this is getting serious, Eric. Mug, this is legit. Who could have done this? What? They massacred his family? Oh my god. They don't mess with Caesar? the wrong Kong. Mug, they must mess with the wrong. Ooh, 
truck. Look at that slow mo. Oh man. But was it really based on a truck? Can't stop this on his own. You see, Kwong, but Kwong got that little salt and pepper too. What kind rush? Oh my god, it's purple now? Oh shit. What is saying? Oh my god. The that new one the is like guy. a orangutan? Yeah, yeah. Orangutan. But that must be the. Oh my god. Oh my Jack God, Eric! Power Rangers, this oh motherfucker! My. Man! Welcome to my world! Wow. Godzilla time Kong! At it! Hmm. Is that a mini Kong? What Kong? Wow. wow, Mark! Okay, I don't know if you saw, he has like a robotic thing on his arm. Right. The bad guy. I don't understand the bad guy. If you remember Godzilla 2, right. there was the, the main one that's like a dragon with right. the three heads. You had that one. Then you had the other one that looked like an eagle. Right. Then you had... There was like about three or four main titans and the second Godzilla. What I'm not I'm... understanding this orangutan looking... Uh, yeah. This like tiny orangutan looking monkey. Well, that's gonna I'm, fight Godzilla and 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 uh, King Kong at this point. There's only one answer for this, bro. Godzilla King Kong meets Planet of the Apes. <laughs> yeah, hey. I'm not gonna lie. That's a possibility. I mean, it looks good, but at this point, I don't know how far they can take this because okay, the first movie it's introducing Godzilla. The second movie it's Godzilla versus a bunch of other titans. Right. Now, Kong, the original King Kong, it's the one with Samuel L. Jackson. He goes to the island, Skull Island. They go. Then that was the introduction of Kong, right? Then you put Godzilla versus King Kong. I don't know how far you can take this. You see what I mean? Because they, hear me out, Eric. I was actually talking about this the other day. I was watching Taken all over again. I was watching Taken 1. Then I watched Taken 2. I didn't want to watch the third one because the third one is the one that because of the fact that they killed his ex-wife in the movie. If you remember, the ex-wife dies. To me, that was a big mistake. Why are you killing her, her character off the movie? Like if one was, was great, then you go for two. If two was good, at some point you got to be like, you know what? Let me let me stop because I feel like where can you really take the story if you keep producing movies? Like Like for example, John Wick. We're on John Wick 4 at this point. How far can you... I'll keep watching John Wick because I love... I love the movie. I love the action and everything. But look, John Wick 4 that I saw the other day. To me, it was not as good as the first two or three. When I say it wasn't good, the action was fantastic and everything. Right. But how far can you take a movie if you keep producing the same thing? At this point, how far can they take Godzilla and King Kong, in my opinion... That's my question I'm asking. What I feel is this. As long as people keep watching, Hollywood, it's all about the bag, about the, making the money, right? They look at the ratings. They look at how much oh, yeah. money they make. If they're making money, they're going to invent anything just to put another one out there. It's like, bro, like when you're, the first thing that came to mind, the Fast and the Furious. That's uh, my point. How um, far are they going to go with this? You know, exactly. That, that movie, they're already on, on Fast and the Furious 34. I mean, at this point, <laughs> you, what's his name you can't even this guy's about 75 years old Vin Diesel I mean that, what, what, what are they gonna you know but like, they're gonna like keep I, making it like if the movie's good I'll keep watching it but if the movie right. like for example after I saw the Meg 1 right which was a disaster right they just came out with the Meg 2 not a couple Meg months ago worse. you think I watched it it's worse I didn't even watch it right. I put it on the TV dude when it came out on the, I think it was HBO dude I the first five minutes, I saw the CGI was so bad with the dinosaurs. I was like, get the hell. I, I exited. I, like, I was like, I can't go watch it. I feel like the old movies, they had more juice to them. Like, let me give you an example. Rocky, right? Of course, when they started getting into the new, newer Rockies, they messed it up. But the first three ones, when it was 
uh, when it was Sylvester Stallone, those were good. The first Rambo's, they were great. Rambo one, two, and three. Those were great. Now you're getting into this time where it doesn't matter what they put. It's like cars, bro. Back in the days, cars used to be solid. Now a car, you go like this, it breaks because they want this production, right? But it's money, it's money, it's money. They want to make money. And, you know? and again, I'm not saying that this is not gonna be good. I'm just saying. Right. Like what I saw right there, uh, it looks good, but I'm not saying it, it doesn't look epic to me because right. it. We've already seen them. It's right. like a horror movie. After right. you see the entity or the like, bad guy so many times, right? It doesn't have an effect on you anymore. Yeah. Like for example, when I first saw the Nun, the first Nun movie, I was terrified. Right. I watched the Nun two the other day, and they showed her so much in the movie. You fell asleep. It didn't do anything to me. You see what right. I mean? Thanks for watching, guys. Let us know your opinion. Don't forget to subscribe. Thumbs up. And we'll see you next time. Let's go, man. Peace. Peace.